so if you've only got 10 minutes, let's get right started. We're going to start this practice in child's pose. So you can have your knees as wide as the mat, toes touching, and then lean your chest forward, arms extended, and let your head hang. And just stay here for a few deep breaths to focus our energy. And then let's just walk our fingers over to our left side to increase the stretch on the left side of our body. And then keeping them extended, let's walk the hands all the way over to the other side. Coming back to the center, you can lift your hips up a little bit and we're just going to thread the needle. So, <laughs> thread the needle. So the right hand is going to come underneath the left, leg ears down towards the mat. And just go for a little stretch in your lower back. A little bit of a twist. Use your left hand to bring yourself back up, and we'll just switch on over to the other side. And just gonna bring yourself up into tabletop position where your hips are over your knees, shoulders over wrists. And we're just gonna do some cat cows, dropping your belly, looking up on the inhale. And then rounding your back, tapping your chin on the exhale. And then having your toes touch, shift the hips up. And down the dog, you can walk it out. Try and get your chest towards your thighs. And we're going to go through those movements a couple times. So bring your shoulders over your wrist. Knees come down into tabletop. Inhaling, looking up, arching your back. And then exhale, tuck your chin to your chest. And tuck the toes and hips come up for downward dog. You can find some stillness. Press into all ten fingers. And then one more time, shift your weight forward. Bring your knees down. Drop your belly, lift your gaze. Round your upper back, tuck your toes, and down like dog. Mm, shifting back into plank. Knees can come down if you need. Keep your elbows in and we're going to lower all the way down to the floor. Untuck your toes. Lift your chest open for cobra. And then roll yourself down. Roll the shoulders back. Come up for cobra and look over your left shoulder. And come forward and roll down. Let's do that one more time. Lifting up for cobra and then look over your right shoulder. Looking forward, roll down. We're going to go for a little twist here, so let's extend our left arm out, palm down. And then we're going to bend our right leg and bring it across our body. And then bring everything back to the center and we're going to switch sides. So extend your right arm and bend your left leg and bring it across your body. This is a good stretch for the shoulder and a little twist for your back. Bring everything back to the center. Hands are going to come under your shoulders. We're going to work on some chaturanga strength with some push-ups. So to start, let's just go up to our knees. So elbows stay in and push all the way up. Just onto your knees. Keep everything nice and tight. And then drop it all the way down to the floor with control. Let's try that again. Push all the way up. And with control, slower than you want to go, come all the way down. You can either keep doing that two more times or for the full push-up, come onto your toes, lift your kneecaps, 
then push all the way up. Let's do one more time. Slowly lower all the way down. Engage the legs, lift the knees, and push all the way up. Awesome. Now let's shift the hips up for downward dog. And we're going to walk our feet up to our forward fold at the top of our mat. You can come up on your fingertips, bend your legs, however you can comfortably get to your forward fold. And let your head hang. If it feels comfortable for you, you can give your hands a massage by stepping on them. Maybe rock back and forth. If you trust yourself not to fall on your face. <laughs> and then release your hands, tuck your chin to your chest, and slowly roll up to standing. Let's inhale the arms out to the side and come up. And dive forward, hinge at the hips. Forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, full, plant your hands, step your right leg back. You can find some movement here. Tighten your legs in towards each other and bring your arms up for high lunge. We'll just stay here just for a moment before diving back down, pushing off that back foot and coming into a forward fold. Inhale the halfway lift. Exhale, fold. This time, step your left leg back. Find your center, and then bring your arms up for a high lunge on the other side. Hands come down, chest to your thigh, and push up, forward fold. One more time each side. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Gonna step our right leg back. Bring our arms up for a high lunge on the other side. And without wasting too much time, we'll dive back forward, plant our hands, and this time, before your forward fold, if you wanna try standing split, you push off that back foot and lift that back leg up. If you wanna try a half moon, you plant your left fingertips a little bit in front of the standing foot and over to the left. Open your hips to the side, and top arm can come up. You can stay looking at the floor or up at your extended hand. Exhale, bring everything down. Gently step your feet together. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. We're going to step that left leg back. Inhale the arms up for high lunge. Don't forget to breathe. Dive forward and go for those balances on the other side. Push off that back leg, standing split. Try not to hyperextend your standing leg. You can plant your right fingertips a little bit, about a foot in front and a little over to the right. Open your hips up to the side. And then bring your arm up, keep stacking your shoulders. Engage both legs. And then bring everything down, gently come to your forward fold. And then bring your hips to your heels. If it feels okay on your knees, you can do a little bit of a bounce. And then we're gonna bring our hands behind us to come into seated. Sit up nice and tall with your legs extended. Inhale the arms overhead. And exhale, fold forward. Inhale, gently roll up. We're going to tuck our left foot in. Center ourselves over our extended leg. Inhale the arms up. And fold forward. We're just going to switch sides. We're almost done. Right leg comes in. Arms overhead. And fold. Sit up nice and tall, and if you're on a roll, you can keep going, but your 10 minutes is done for the day, so great job. Have a good one.